Nathan, congratulations, second Thank place you. for yourself. What does that mean to you? It's just really nice to get back out here. You know, to jump 1694, to get the world standard is it's just amazing for me right now. Um, everybody's, everybody knows the kind of history I've had the last few years. Just to finally get back to the distances that I know that I can do, and I know that I can jump further than this. It's just really nice. Um, it was a little frustrating picking up a strain before the European Team Championships, because I knew I was in this shape, if not better. But I had to make a smart call to make sure I didn't make the injury even worse. And I think, so I think that shows that it was the right decision, because I came here today, jumped 16.94. What you can also see was, because my preparation was affected a little bit, the later rounds, it was hard for me to try and react to what I wanted to do. I could feel I was tired, but I was trying to push myself, but unfortunately I couldn't do it, so Julian obviously took the goal. Just on that world qualifying standard, obviously that's the key part of today. Yeah. Um, to have made that uh, and sort of to see the form you're in now, you must be full of confidence. No, for sure. You know, what I want to do now is get hopefully a you know, world standard competition, go and mix it with the world's best because they're the competitions that I love and try and push on from there really, you know, increase my distances and try and solidify my place for the World Championships. What would it mean to be out there and compete amongst the world's finest in Beijing? Oh, amazing. You know, it's like I said, everybody knows the battle I've been through. Um, and I've just been determined to get myself all the way back up there, for absolute sure. So I'm hoping this is just the beginning, really. You know, 1694, it's a good distance and it's a decent distance. But everybody knows that I can jump a lot further than that. So hopefully now I can find some fitness and start moving towards those distances. Just on that injury, just tell us, talk us briefly through that and why, what, why it means so much to you now to be back here and competing amongst Britain's best and hopefully going on to succeed in the world stage as well. Well, the thing is, I've been out with injury probably since 2011, picked up a big injury. 2012, Mr. Hugh got, got a huge injury again, which was just devastating. You know, to miss a home Olympic Games was hard. And then to try and find fitness in 2013-14 was hard because I was still having complications with those same injuries. So now to be healthy just feels amazing. You know, and, and that's literally it, is that I'm healthy. You know, but I need to get fitter. So it's, it's great to jump 16.94 when I'm healthy, but I'm just hoping you know, I get myself fitter and I'll push on.